to see if the if the uh, upper jugular vein comes up now, uh, having got some fluids in. Oh, that's an awful sound. Now steady. Now steady, 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 steady. Not wanting to show. I'm not confident that I can see it in amongst the bruising, the bleeding that's gone un underneath. I'm not confident yet. I don't want to inject into an air sac or something like that and drown him, so I'll need to know what I'm doing. Alright, well, we'll have a look under a wing. I'll have a look at the elbow. And we'll part the skin there. And we'll put pressure on up here with this finger up in here. And we've got a vein coming up there. It's only a little one, but we'll have a shot at that in a moment. Uh, the next step is just to change the needles on these syringes. We've warmed the fluid to about body temperature. I mean, that's calcium. We don't want yeah. to inject that one. There's another one up there. You have to be awake, don't you? Stay awake. Stay awake, I see. Right, okay. Intravenous fluids. So, we'll see. It's just steady, 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 steady. Steady, mate. Steady, mate. We'll see how calm we can keep him while we do this. And if he holds still, we'll be lest we have a thing. They obvious, often get a haematoma here. Right, that's not in. Not happy. Right, that's not going in. That's not what we want. And that is why we don't normally go to the this vein as the first thing. So I have to keep pressure on that to stop it developing into a big blood blister. I'll try once more. But otherwise we'll give the rest of the fluids subcutaneously. When he's like this, if I can get them intravenously, I would prefer to. But I just need to keep finger on that for two or three minutes. You can save the battery.